obviously a great starting point. So when we think of a biopsy, usually it's a needle-based biopsy. And so we're getting a small sample of the tumor. Um, and, and this is obviously in the context of uveal melanoma or presumed uveal melanoma. So we're getting a small sample of the tumor. And most of the time, this is for prognostication, basically for determining the risk of metastatic spread in the future. We also know that sometimes we can use this for um, diagnostic confirmation, basically meaning to confirm that this is a uveal melanoma by looking at the cells in pathology. But for the most part, it is a clinical diagnosis. And so we usually use the biopsy to determine risk of spread down the road. Okay. So you talked about a fine needle biopsy. Um, so before we, well, I guess let's talk about the mechanisms of like, what does that mean? Um, because a lot of um, a lot of the patient community have been told by doctors or um, just throughout various different times, you know, we hear it floating around in the cancer community that like, oh, don't get a biopsy, it's going to make your cancer spread. Can you talk to us about like how does this biopsy physically work and what are the risks and what are kind of the the safe features, safety features, I guess, that are kind of a part of the process. Yeah, sure. Absolutely. So when we think about a fine needle, we're really talking about a very, very small gauge needle, um, sometimes 25, 27, or even 30 gauge, depending on uh, which provider is performing the biopsy. So depending on the location.